through the list of vitamin B1, which is thiamine deficiency symptoms. And you may be low, it's easy to have this type of deficiency. Let's go through the list. Okay, number one is low energy and fatigue. B vitamins typically give us a lot of energy and they're depleted very quickly when we're stressed out. Okay, number two is depression, low mood because you're low in vitamin B1. Number three is short-term memory loss and memory impairment. Your vitamin B1 has a lot to do with your proper brain function, which is number four is brain dysfunction and even loss of balance when you are low in vitamin B1. Number five on the list with B1 deficiency, indigestion, gut issues, gut health issues, the gas, the bloating, because you're low in vitamin B1. Number six on the list is difficulty with breathing, shortness of breath. Number seven, and this is really common, is water retention. And you gain water weight very quickly when you're low in vitamin B1. And number eight, irritability. Remember, this is affecting our central nervous system as well. So that irritability can be because you're low in thiamine. Now, who is at risk of a thiamine deficiency? Well, if you drink a lot of alcohol or maybe even not a lot, you're just drinking regularly, that severely depletes your vitamin B1 levels. Up to 20 to 30% of older adults, and this is according to the NIH, are actually low in vitamin B1. You simply don't absorb it as well as you're aging. If you're a diabetic or your blood sugar levels are not properly regulated, this will also deplete your vitamin B1 when that sugar is high. And if you've had gastric bypass surgery, bariatric surgery, this also puts you at that risk of that low B1 absorption, you may be low in that thiamine. Now the good news is though, there are some foods that can help to boost your thiamine levels, your vitamin B1. So check out my video, best foods to boost vitamin B1. I'll see you there.